We're talking about the most important development in laboratory information management systems. Check it out. Meet Colin Thurston. He's our expert in laboratory information management systems. Colin, here at PitCon 2011, we've got a brand new product, and everyone knows we are the leader in LIMS, but tell them what's new. In this release of Sample Manager, Sample Manager 10, we've developed a whole new set of functionality to, to affect really three different types of users. So from an end user point of view, and from an IT point of view, and also from a, a management point of view. For the end user, we've uh, come up with a concept around landing pages for uh, how they operate with the system so that those users will have an environment that actually matches the things that they want to see in the lab. So they'll go in and they'll see just the samples they need to process or just the instruments that they need to work with. But on top of that, we've also put in some new functionality, things around the calibration and maintenance of, of instruments, uh, and also things like uh, being able to schedule samples on, on a number of different bases to allow them to carry out regular tasks automatically. From an IT perspective, we've also put in a whole new uh, framework based on Microsoft's .NET framework. Uh, and this means that from a technical perspective, it's a lot easier for, for companies to manage the system, to configure the system using industry standard tools. From a business user point of view, we've also put in the concept of, of dashboards. So making data available outside the lab to enable higher level users to make proper business decisions based on, on the information they're getting from the laboratory. If we focus really on, on compliance, because that's a real challenge for a lot of our customers, particularly ones in, in industries that have not necessarily had so much of a compliance burden like the water and environmental industry or the food safety industry. So what we've done is put in a, a whole series of, of features that allow those uh, laboratories to trace things like operator training records and to be able to trace that process for right from the start of receiving a sample through processing it using an instrument right through to, to generating a, a final report or a batch release process. Learn more at thermoscientific.com slash sample manager 10.